The Sealy How To Do Video Guide for Vehicle Battery Fault Diagnosis Modern vehicles have a multitude of electrical systems which can in time drain a battery causing starting problems. Most people assume the fault lies with the vehicle's battery, but the fault could lie elsewhere. This guide is designed to help you quickly diagnose the problem using a multimeter and a few tools, which can save you replacing components unnecessarily. Step 1. Turn on your multimeter and, if you're working on a 12 volt vehicle, set it accordingly. In this case it needs to be set to 20 volts DC. Step 2. Connect the red positive lead to the positive terminal of your battery. This will have a cross mark near it. Then connect the black negative lead to the negative terminal. This is marked with a minus sign. Step 3. The multimeter should show you how many volts the battery is producing. If the reading is below 12 volts, you need to charge the battery using a battery charger. Step 4. Now leave the multimeter connected and start the vehicle's engine. The reading should increase to somewhere between 13.5 and 14.5 volts. If the reading is lower, the alternator is possibly at fault and may need repairing or replacing. But before replacing the alternator, check the drive belt is correctly tightened and that all the battery and alternator leads are clean and tightened. If any are very dirty or loose, clean and tighten them and then repeat steps 3 and 4. Step 5. In the event that the alternator is working correctly, you'll need to check for any parasitic drains within the electrical system. This is when an electrical component develops a fault and continues to draw power even when the engine is turned off. Some modern cars, however, have built-in computers which continue to run certain components for a short period after the engine is switched off. Check with the manufacturer or online before carrying out step 6. Step 6. Start the vehicle's engine. Connect a clip-on ammeter to the negative battery lead. It should show a very low reading. Check with the vehicle manufacturer for the correct figure. If the reading is above this figure, you have a parasitic drain. However, unless you're competent in car electrics, it may be necessary to take the vehicle to a main dealer or an auto electrician for further assistance.